Welcome to the moon. After 50 years, the U.S. has once again landed on the moon, and a Houston-based space company is celebrating that accomplishment. Intuitive Machines landed their spacecraft on the moon's southern surface. And over the next week or so, they'll be collecting data to help with future missions. KPRC2 CJ Parker is live at the company's facilities at the Houston Spaceport. TJ, big, big news this morning. What is next for the mission? Yeah, certainly big news, and you can imagine the celebration that happened here at Intuitive Machines last night. It only seems right that it was a Houston-based company, a space city-based company, to work on this historic project, and now the real work begins. Houston, Odysseus has found his new home. Now that history has been made, the work to collect data begins. Tucked on board are six science payloads that are expected to operate for up to seven days on the lunar surface, including the navigation Doppler LIDAR instrument, which helped the spacecraft land. Also on board is some art and technology, including some insulation material developed by Columbia Sportswear, which is designed to shield Odysseus from the harsh moon temperatures. This is quite an emotional feeling to... Uh... To be here. This is a small little company trying to do something that is very bold. Yes, very cool. The last time the U.S. landed on the moon was the Apollo 17 mission back in 1972. So NASA paid Intuitive Machines $118 million for this mission and again will have a huge impact on future exploration. All of this really is to look at the environment of the moon, specifically there on the South Pole before NASA sends a crewed mission there, hopefully by late. 2026. Reporting live this morning, I'm TJ Parker, KPRC 2 News. All right, TJ, 